If you are someone who suffers with acid reflux or GERD, I have a question for you. Is your fat giving you your acid reflux. It's interesting to note that in the research, it has been found that there is a link, especially with visceral fat, and that visceral fat is that fat that accumulates around our organ systems. And they found in this study that the visceral fat may increase the risk of reflux esophagitis by increasing the levels of inflammatory cytokines. Now, another connection was made with leptin levels. And if you've seen my content before on leptin resistance, you know that this is something that I'm very passionate about educating you about why leptin resistance is so important to fix in terms of your hormonal balance, but it could be related to that reflux esophagitis as well and your acid reflux because it was found that leptin showed a positive association with that acid reflux. So again, that stomach acid coming up through the stomach and up into the esophagus, which I know you've got those burning pains that can be really debilitating for your overall health. But the good news is I have a great hack how to stop that acid reflux instantly. So this is something that I suffered with through my pregnancies and I was downing a lot of antacids and not really the best and most natural way to treat this. But I have found something so much better. So occasionally if Again, if you do eat something that doesn't agree with you, then you can use this hack. But if you have an ongoing acid reflux issue, one of the things you can use is magnesium. Magnesium by its nature is more basic and it will counteract some of that acid that's happening in the esophagus and coming up through the stomach. Now, the other aspect of magnesium in particularly magnesium bisglycinate, so bound to glycine, and I'm gonna open it up for you to show you you, and this is something that you can do by opening up that magnesium bisglycinate into some water in the morning, and that's a great time to take your magnesium because it helps with your metabolism. But doing this, opening this up and sipping on this in the morning is a great way to not only quell that acid, because this is basic, but also helps to relax the specific muscles at the bottom of the esophagus. So this will help to relax the lower esophageal sphincter, help helping to keep the acid down in the stomach where it's supposed to be, and this is a great way to help to balance this out. Now, it may also be indicated to definitely fix your leptin resistance, so if you wanna know more about that, check out my other videos. And it's really interesting that in other studies, it's been found that those who do have GERD or acid reflux had very much higher leptin levels compared to those people who didn't have acid reflux. Today, I shared the aspect of is your fat giving you your acid reflux, so a question you can ask yourself and hopefully find some solutions for your acid reflux. So if you do want more tips on how to manage that acid reflux, please check out my video, Do These Nine Tips to Treat Acid Reflux. I'll see you there.